For cheap Minecraft hosting, be sure to go ahead and check out Clovex.net. What is going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to downgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 8.1 or Windows 7. Now Microsoft actually uses a built-in feature where you can downgrade the new Windows 10 version to the older 8.1 or 7. Now there is one downside to this, you only have one month to go back to where you was. Meaning, if you got Windows 10 today, you only have one month to go back to either Windows 8.1 or 7, or if you bypass that one month, then you're going to need to buy the actual installation for Windows 7 or Windows 8.1. Right now, it's 100% free, so if you're watching this and you've gone over a month, then I believe you cannot get it back unless you go ahead and purchase it. Now, before you do this, make sure you back up your PC data. Now, you can do this with external hard drives, thumb drives, online cloud storage, such as OneDrive, Google Drive, or even Dropbox. Now, this process is said to only take 10 minutes. So, first of all, what you'll do is go to Start and you want to head to Settings. Now from there you want to go to update and security. Now on the left side here you want to click recovery. Now you'll see right here, because I was on Windows 7 before I upgraded to Windows 10, I get the option to go back to Windows 7. If you were on Windows 8.1 or Windows 8, then you'd get the option to go back to Windows 8.1 or Windows 8. And then from there you just click get started. Now I'm not actually going to do this because I don't want to downgrade, however, the next step after you've done this, you'll be presented with a blue screen with options asking why you want to downgrade, choose the desired, and then click next. Now before the downgrade process starts, Windows provides you with a couple of options to cancel it. It also reminds you of the password you had on the previous version, which you need once the process is complete. Now the final step is just to press next. Now your device will revert to the older version of Windows. So that is it, it's very simple to do and only supposed to take 10 minutes, it's built in with Microsoft's Windows 10. Now remember, you only have one month to revert, if you go over that one month, you won't be able to revert using this video, you need to go ahead and purchase Windows 7 or Windows 8 and it's going to be at a cost. So anyway, that's it for this video, thanks so much for watching, I hope this video has helped you, be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated what I'll be posting and what I'll be posting, also be sure to go and check out my gaming channel, I'll post 3-4 times a week, and finally be sure to go and add me on Snapchat to see what I do throughout my day. This guy's been Casual Savage here, thanks so much for watching, please subscribe, rate, and peace.